Hey guys, Nabil here with some new Samurai Showdown updates. First of all, there is a massive Samurai Showdown tournament uh, taking place in Japan tomorrow. It's a 125 players tournament. Yes, that's 100, sorry, 128 people uh, that are gonna compete. Some of the biggest uh, Japanese players will be uh, taking participating in this tournament. The top 16 of the Samurai Showdown official SNK tournament will be streamed in different languages. It will be streamed on the official SNK channel at, on, on YouTube. It will also be restreamed uh, live, of course, uh, with uh, James Chen commentary on his um, Twitch uh, Twitch channel. You can you can have a, you can check the link in the description. And this is gonna take place at around 6 p.m. Uh, Japanese Standard Time. Um, so again, tomorrow Saturday, 6 JST. There's gonna be some crazy Samurai Showdown action. We're gonna see some of the top Japanese players before we see them at Evo next week. So this is gonna be very exciting. I will definitely be watching that stream and I will comment on it and hopefully be able to do some of the top moments of this uh, tournament. Now, speaking of EVO, and I just mentioned EVO is happening next week. Remember when I said that there's, there's a, this Japanese event where uh, Rimuru is going to be playable? Well, Rimuru is going to be also playable at EVO. This is the first time again it's gonna, she's going to be playable. It's the same time, it's around the same time as the uh, events that they have, a couple of events they have in Japan, which is the National Entertainment Festival, Zentame. Attendees of uh, EVO will also be able to test and try the arcade version of Samurai Showdown on Nessica Live 2. Now, get this, this version, this arcade version will actually have online. So people on the arcade in EVO uh, in the US will be able at the same time to play against people in Japan. So we're talking cross-continent netcode. So I'm not sure if this is the same netcode that we have. I believe they're testing this new netcode as well. So attendees will be able uh, will have the opportunity to compete directly with players in Japan through the online arcade mode. They do specify, however, that they might uh, be able, they, they might uh, cancel, well not cancel, but they might uh, uh, they might stop this test if the connection is very bad, if the signal, if the uh, in the event of a poor signal strength, but they will try. So it's going to be people in um, in an Evo. They will be playing against people from at the Zentame um, uh, festival as well as the arcade spots in Sapporo and Fukuoka. So four locations, three of them in Japan, one of them at Evo, and you know they'll be able to try online and, and if it works great then I can't wait for them to use that netcode on the actual home version of Samurai Showdown. Now uh, now that I that I talked about uh, Rimuru being playable and talked about the Nesika Live uh, there's also some cool stuff I want to mention. Um, first of all uh, you actually can get Samurai Showdown a lot cheaper now at Amazon. Uh, if you have not bought Samurai Showdown or you want a second copy, you want to put it, put it in your shelf or give you know give it as a gift, you can do that now as Samurai Showdown both on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One costs $49. Uh, currently this is a special, this is not the new price of the game or anything like that, but they're going with this um, you know special price for a few days. So if you don't do not have Samurai Showdown, this is your chance to get it cheap. So that's pretty much it guys, just a couple updates. Evo is getting very very close. Tomorrow is gonna be a big day for the eSport, Samurai Showdown eSport. Uh, we're going to have the 128 player tournament. It's the official Samurai Showdown SNK tournament. I can't wait to see how, what's the level of the Japanese players and see, to just to have an idea on how things are gonna go at Evo next week. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, a couple quick updates. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like, and see you guys next time.